Professor Catherine Dulac from Harvard University made an interesting discovery about paternal love that was published in the science journal Nature. Sexually experienced males and females display parental care. A subset of gallinin expressing neurons in the medial preoptic area that are specifically activated during male and female parenting. Optogenetic activation of these neurons in virgin males suppresses intermale and pup directed aggression and induces pup grooming. According to the report, when a male mouse becomes a father, its body changes in order to raise its baby. Normally, male mice attack the young ones or bite to kill them. However, the male mouse that became a father started to build its nest and search for food after its babies were born. The research team found that the smell of the baby mouse stimulates a certain nerve cell and changes the father mouse's behavioral habits to a paternal mode so it can take care of its babies. The research team named this nerve cell the paternal switch since it activates paternal love just like turning on a switch through the birth of its babies. Studies have also been done at Princeton University in the United States that shows paternal love is already present in father cells. The research team studied a father monkey that carries its baby on his back for over 15 hours a day. Marmoset fathers take care of their babies all day long. Based on a study that compared the brains of monkeys that had babies to monkeys that did not have babies, the brains of monkeys that had babies contained neurocells that triggered paternal love, which allowed them to take care of their young with the utmost care. Father marmoset monkeys are some of the most devotional fathers on the earth. The prefrontal cortex is the part of the brain that controls planning. Research has shown that father marmoset's brains have more cells and connective tissues than monkeys that haven't had children. Researchers also found prolactin, oxytocin, and vasopressin, known as paternal hormones, in the prefrontal cortex as well. Hormones, even in very small amounts, have a significant effect on our bodies. A person cannot choose whether or not this hormone is secreted. Research has shown that this hormone affects maternal and paternal love. Vasopressin is known as the hormone that helps the body stay hydrated and maintain homeostasis, especially in males. However, the vasopressin hormone works differently for fathers. For men without children, it only functions as a diuretic and moisturizing hormone. But for men with children, this hormone helps them to love their children more and be more devoted to their family. We found that the vasopressin hormone is secreted in very tiny amounts in men who don't have children, but it's secreted quite a bit in men with children. Many scientists believe that the vasopressin hormone helps a man to have more fatherly emotions. 